would the team of only free agents do? So here we have a team full of free agents, and the only way we can sign a player is obviously if he is a free agent. So we started the EFL League One and tried to climb our way into the Champions League final. So the board wants us to win the title, so let's see how we do. Halfway into the season, and we are sitting at first with four point gap to Derby County. We also got two players to straighten our side as we side Malagon as a new goalkeeper and Chavez to control the midfield. So let's finish the season. Let's go free agent. We finished the season at the top of the table and had a nine point gap to second place Peterborough, and we banged 84 goals in total. We got knocked out in the quarterfinals of EFL Trophy against Tramia Rovers and also got knocked out in the first round of Carabao Cup against Grimsby. Second season, here we go. In the second season, we signed loads of new faces, but these were the best ones. New superstar Ibarra to goal, Lucas Acampos, Martin Deroom, and yes, Luka Modric. We sold Sol Bakken and Bukhari, and these are the rest of the players we signed. So the team looks like this and it's pretty impressive, but let's start the season. After half season, we are sitting at third with seven points to first place Burnley. Also in the January, we sold Chavez and signed former Man UTD Shortire, but now let's finish the season. Let's go, boys. We done it back to back as we won the league clearly with eight points gap to Burnley. Also Preston North End are going up to Premier League with us and Burnley. Lucas Ocampos was our top scorer and also won the Golden Boot. And again, we didn't have any success at the EFL or Carabao Cup. Second season done. Like and comment if you want more.